In physics, a surface wave is a mechanical wave that propagates along the interface between differing media, usually as a gravity wave between two fluids with different densities. A surface wave can also be an elastic wave, such as with a Rayleigh or Love wave. It can also be an electromagnetic wave guided by a refractive index gradient. In radio transmission, a ground wave is a surface wave that propagates close to the surface of the Earth. Com. Mechanical waves. In seismology, several types of surface waves are encountered. Surface waves, in this mechanical sense, are commonly known as either love waves or Rayleigh waves. A seismic wave is a wave that travels through the Earth, often as the result of an earthquake or explosion. Love waves have transverse motion whereas Rayleigh waves have both longitudinal and transverse motion. Seismic waves are studied by seismologists and measured by a seismograph or seismometer. Surface waves span a wide frequency range, and the period of waves that are most damaging is usually 10 seconds or longer. Surface waves can travel around the globe many times from the largest earthquakes. Surface waves are caused when P waves and S waves come to the surface. The term surface wave can describe waves over an ocean, even when they are approximated by airy functions and are more properly called creeping waves. Examples are the waves at the surface of water and air, or ripples in the sand at the interface with water or air. Another example is internal waves, which can be transmitted along the interface of two water masses of different densities. Electromagnetic waves Ground waves refer to the propagation of radio waves parallel to and adjacent to the surface of the Earth, following the curvature of the Earth. These surface waves are also known loosely as the Norton surface wave, the Zanuck surface wave, Sommerfeld waves, and gliding waves. See also Diacon of surface waves propagating at the interface of transparent materials with different symmetry. Equals radio propagation equals lower frequencies below 3 MHz, travel efficiently as ground waves. This is because they are more strongly diffracted around obstacles due to their long wavelengths, allowing them to follow the Earth's curvature. The Earth has one refractive index and the atmosphere has another, thus constituting an interface that supports the surface wave transmission. Ground waves propagate in vertical polarization, with their magnetic field horizontal and electric field vertical. At VLF the ionosphere and Earth's surface act as a waveguide. Conductivity of the surface affects the propagation of ground waves, with more conductive surfaces such as sea water providing better propagation. Increasing the conductivity in a surface results in less dissipation. The refractive indices are subject to spatial and temporal changes. Since the ground is not a perfect electrical conductor, Ground waves are attenuated as they follow the Earth a Euro unregistered trademark S surface. The wave fronts initially are vertical, but the ground, acting as a lossy dielectric, causes the wave to tilt forward as it travels. This directs some of the energy into the Earth where it is dissipated, so that the signal decreases exponentially. Most long-distance low-frequency long-wave radio communication is a result of ground wave propagation. Medium wave radio transmissions, including AM broadcast band, travel both as ground waves and, for longer distances at night, as sky waves. Ground losses become lower at lower frequencies, greatly increasing the coverage of AM stations using the lower end of the band. The VLF and LF frequencies are mostly used for military communications, especially with ships and submarines. The lower the frequency, the better the waves penetrate seawater. Even extremely low-frequency waves have been used to communicate with deeply submerged submarines. Surface waves have been used in over-the-horizon radar, which operates mainly at frequencies between 2 and 20 MHz over the sea, which has a sufficiently high conductivity to convey the surface waves to and from a reasonable distance. In the development of radio, surface waves were used extensively. Early commercial and professional radio services relied exclusively on long wave, low frequencies and ground wave propagation. To prevent interference with these services, amateur and experimental transmitters were restricted to the higher frequencies, felt to be useless since their ground wave range was limited. 
upon discovery of the other propagation modes possible at medium wave and short wave frequencies, the advantages of HF for commercial and military purposes became apparent. Amateur experimentation was then confined only to authorized frequencies in the range. Medium wave and short wave reflect off the ionosphere at night, which is known as skywave. During daylight hours, the lower D layer of the ionosphere forms and absorbs lower frequency energy. This prevents sky wave propagation from being very effective on medium wave frequencies in daylight hours. At night, when the D layer dissipates, medium wave transmissions travel better by sky wave. Ground waves do not include ionospheric and tropospheric waves. The propagation of sound waves through the ground taking advantage of the Earth's ability to more efficiently transmit low frequency is known as audio ground wave. Equals microwave field theory equals, within microwave field theory, the interface of a dielectric and conductor supports surface wave transmission. Surface waves have been studied as part of transmission lines and some may be considered as single wire transmission lines. Characteristics and utilizations of the electrical surface wave phenomenon include, the field components of the wave diminish with distance from the interface. Electromagnetic energy is not converted from the surface wave field to another form of energy such that the wave does not transmit power normal to the interface, that is it is evanescent along that dimension. In optical fiber transmission, evanescent waves are surface waves. In coaxial cable in addition to the TEM mode there also exists a transverse magnetic mode which propagates as a surface wave in the region around the central conductor. For coax of common impedance this mode is effectively suppressed but in high impedance coax and on a single central conductor without any outer shield, low attenuation and very broad band propagation is supported. Transmission line operation in this mode is called E-line. See also, waves. Seismic waves, seismic communication, P waves, S waves, surface acoustic wave, sky waves, the primary means of HF transmission, surface plasmon, a longitudinal charge density wave along the interface of conducting and dielectric mediums, surface wave sustained mode, a propagation of electromagnetic surface waves, evanescent waves and evanescent wave coupling, ocean surface waves internal waves and crests, dispersion, and freak waves, love wave and Rayleigh-Lamb wave, gravity waves, occurs at certain natural interfaces, stony wave, sculpt wave, diacon of surface waves, people, Arnold Sommerfeld a Euro published the mathematical treatise on the Zanek wave, Jonathan Zanek a Euro pupil of Sommerfeld, wireless pioneer, developed the Zanek wave, John Stone Stone a Euro wireless pioneer, Produced theories on radio propagation, other, ground constants, the electrical parameters of Earth, near and far field, the radiated field that is within one quarter of a wavelength of the diffracting edge or the antenna and beyond. Skin effect, the tendency of an alternating electric current to distribute itself within a conductor so that the current density near the surface of the conductor is greater than that at its core. Green's function, a function used to solve inhomogeneous differential equations subject to boundary conditions. External articles, further readings, and references. Equals citations equals, this article incorporates public domain material from the General Services Administration document Federal Standard 1037C. The Physical Reality of Zanex Surface Wave. Alcatel Lucent. Diakonov. MI new type of electromagnetic wave propagating at an interface. Soviet Physics JETP 67, 714. Naval Electrical Engineering Training Series, Chapter 2 Radio Wave Propagation, Ground Waves. Integrated Publishing. Antennas and Radio Propagation, TM 11 to 666, Department of the Army, February 1953. Pages 17 a Euro 23. HTTP, www.jpier.org peer 19 slash 02.970718p. Link SUPDF, Colin, RE, Field Theory of Guided Waves, Chapter 11 Surface Wave Guides. New York, Wiley IEEE Press, 1990. Mode. 
equals websites equals Eric W. Wellerstein, AL, Surface Wave, Eric Wellerstein's World of Physics, 2006. Surface Waves. Integrated Publishing. David Race, Electromagnetic Surface Waves. The Net Advance of Physics, Special Reports, No. 1, Gary Peterson, Rediscovering the Zanuck Wave. Feedline No. 4. 3D Waves by Jesse Nichella based on a program by Stephen Wolfram, Wolfram Demonstrations Project. Equals Patents equals, U.S. Patent 2,685,068, Surface Wave Transmission Line. George J. Gaubau, U.S. Patent 2,921,277, Launching and Receiving of Surface Waves. George J. Gaubau. U.S. Patent 7,567,154, Surface Wave Transmission System over a single conductor having E fields terminating along the conductor. Glenn E. Elmore. Equals Standards and Doctrines equals, Surface Wave. Telecom Glossary 2000, ATIS Committee T1A1, Performance and Signal Processing, T1.523-2001. Surface Wave. Federal Standard 1037C. Surface Wave, MILS TD 188, Multi Service Tactics, Techniques, and Procedures for the High Frequency Automatic Link Establishment, FM 6 02.74. MCRP 3 40.3E. NTTP 6 02.6. AFTTP, I, 3 2.48. Contents to M2000.7 September, 2003. Equals Books equals, Barlow, H. M., and Brown, J., Radio Surface Waves, Oxford University Press 1962. Budden, K. G., Radio Waves in the Ionosphere. The Mathematical Theory of the Reflection of Radio Waves from Stratified Ionized Layers. Cambridge, Eng., University Press, 1961. LCCN 61016040 R85, Budden, KG, The Waveguide Mode Theory of Wave Propagation. London, Logos Press. Englewood Cliffs, New Jersey, Prentice Hall, C1961. LCCN 62002870 L, Budden, KG, The Propagation of Radio Waves. The Theory of Radio Waves of Low Power in the Ionosphere and Magnetosphere. Cambridge. New York, Cambridge University Press, 1985. ISBN 0-521-25461-2 LCCN 84028498, Colin, R. E., Field Theory of Guided Waves. New York, Wiley IEEE Press, 1990. Foti, S., Lee, C. G., Rix, G. J., and Strobier, C., A Euro OE Surface Wave Methods for Near Surface Site Characterization A Euro, CRC Press, Boca Raton, Florida, 487 pp, ISBN 9780415678766, 2014, Sommerfeld, A. Partial Differential Equations in Physics, Academic Press Incorporated, New York, 1949, Chapter 6 Problems of Radio. Polo, J.R., J.A., Mackay, T.G., and Lorch-Takia, A., Electromagnetic Surface Waves, A Modern Perspective. Waltham, Massachusetts, USA, Elsevier, 2013. Rohr, K., Wave Propagation in the Ionosphere. Dordgd, Kluwerak at Pub. 1993. Sommerfeld, A., Partial Differential Equations in Physics, Academic Press Incorporated, New York, 1949, Chapter 6 Problems of Radio. Weiner, Melvin M., Monopole Antennas New York, Marcel Decker, 2003. ISBN 0-8247-0496-7, Wait, J.R. Electromagnetic Wave Theory, New York, Harper and Row, 1985. Wait, J.R., The Waves in Stratified Media. New York, Pergamon, 
1962. Waldron, Richard Arthur, Theory of Guided Electromagnetic Waves. London, New York, Van Nostrand Reynold, 1970. ISBN 0-442-09167-2LCCN 69019848R86, Weiner, Melvin M., Monopole Antennas New York, Marcel Decker, 2003. ISBN 0 8247 0496 7 Equals journals and papers equals Zanek, Sommerfeld, Norton, and Galbau J. Zanek Pra Copyright Side Atar Copyright La Copyright Graphie Sans Phil, Compla Copyright Ment de Leverage, Le Oscillations A Copyright Electromagna Copyright Tx A La Tar Copyright La Copyright Graphie Sans Phil, Paris, Gautier Villas, 1911. Vis 385 PL. 26 cm, J. Zanek. Arbeit die Fortpflanzung Abener Elektromantische Wellen La Currency NGS Einer Abenen Later für Currency Che und der Besiehung zur Drehtlosen Telegraphie, Annalen der Physik, Vol. 23, pages 846 a Euro 866, September 1907. J. Zanek, Elektromantische und Gungen und Drehtlos Telegraphie, Gart, F. Enk, 1905. XXVII, 1019 Peel. 24 cm, J. Zanek, Wireless Telegraphy, New York, etc. McGraw-Hill Book Company, Inc., 1st ed. 1915 XX, 443p. Illus, DIAGRS. 24 cm. LCCN 15024534, A. Sommerfeld. Arbeit die Fortpflanzung Elektrodynamische Wellen La Currency NGS Einstraats, and der Physik und Chemie, Vol. 67, pages 233 Euro 290, December 1899. A. Sommerfeld, Arbeit die Ausbrüchung der Wellen in der Drehtlosen Telegraphie, Annal und der Physik, Vol. 28, pages 665 to 736, March 1909. A. Sommerfeld, Propagation of Waves in Wireless Telegraphy, An. Fizz, Vol. 81, pages 1367 Euro 1153, 1926. K. A. Norton, The Propagation of Radio Waves Over the Surface of the Earth and in the Upper Atmosphere, Proc. I. R. E., Vol. 24, pages 1367 Euro 1387, 1936. K. A. Norton, The Calculations of Ground Wave Field Intensity Over a Finitely Conducting Spherical Earth, Proc. I. R. E., Vol. 29, pages 623 Euro 639, 1941. G. Galbao, Surface Waves and Their Application to Transmission Lines, J. A. P. P. L. Fizz, Vol. 21, pages 1119 Euro 1128. November, 1950. G. Galbau, a Euro OA Obadizen Expo den Well, a Euro, Zeitschrift für Orange und Physik, Vol. 3, 1951, NRS 3 quarters, pages 103 to 107. Wait, wait, J.R., Lateral Waves in the Pioneering Research of the Late Kenneth A. Norton. Wait, J.R., and D.A. Hill. Excitation of the HF surface wave by vertical and horizontal apertures. Radio Science, 14, 1979, pages 767 to 780. Wait, J.R., and D.A. Hill, Excitation of the Zanuck surface by a vertical aperture. Radio Science, 13, 1978, pages 967 to 977. Wait, J.R., a note on surface waves and ground waves, i.e. E. transactions on antennas and propagation, November 1965. Volume 13, Issue 6, PG 996-997 ISSN 0096-1973, Wait, J.R., The Ancient and Modern History of M. Ground Wave Propagation. i.e. E. E. Antennas Propagat. Mag, Volume 40. Pages 7 a Euro 24, October 1998. Wait, J.R., Appendix E, 
on the theory of ground wave propagation over a slightly ruined curved Earth, electromagnetic probing in geophysics. Boulder, Colorado, Gollum, 1971, pages 37 a Euro 381. Weight, J.R., Electromagnetic Surface Waves, Advances in Radio Research, 1, New York, Academic Press, 1964, pages 157 to 219. Others, are E. Colin, Hertz and Dipole Radiating Over a Lossy Earth or Sea, Some Early and Late 20th Century Controversies, Antennas and Propagation Magazine, 46, 2004, pages 64 to 79. F. J. Zucker, Surface Wave Antennas and Surface Wave Excited Arrays, Antenna Engineering Handbook, 2nd ed., R. C. Johnson and H. Jasek, eds. New York, McGraw-Hill, 1984. Hill, D. and J. R. Waite, Excitation of the Zenex Surface Wave by a Vertical Aperture, Radio Science, Vol. 13, No. 6, November a Euro December, 1978, pages 969 to 977. U. V. Kister Beach, Possibility of observing Zenex surface waves in radiation from a source with a small vertical aperture, Soviet Physics Technical Physics, Vol. 34, No. 4, April, 1989, pages 391 to 394. V. I. Borbakov, V. N. Datsko, U. V. Kista Beach, Experimental Discovery of Zenex Surface Electromagnetic Waves, Sovfiz Uspekhi, 1989, 32, 378 379. Coram, K. L. and J. F. Coram, The Zenex Surface Wave, Nikola Tesla, Lightning Observations, and Stationary Waves, Appendix 2. 1994. M. J. King and J. C. Wilts, Surface Wave Propagation on Coated or Uncoated Metal Wires at Millimeter Wavelengths. J. A. P. P. L. Fizz, Volume 21, pages 1119 a Euro 1128. November, M. J. King and J. C. Wilts, Surface Wave Propagation on a Dielectric Rod of Electric Cross Section. Electronic Communications, Incorporated, Ternonium. KLD. Psi. Rept. No one, AFCKL contract no. AF19, 601, minus 5475. August, 1960. T. Kahn and G. Cart, on the electromagnetic surface wave of Sommerfeld, Viz. Rev 76, 406 a Euro 410. Equals other media equals, L. A. Ostrovsky. Laboratory Modeling and Theoretical Studies of Surface Wave Modulation by a Moving Sphere, M. Oceanic and Atmospheric Research Laboratories, 2002. OCLC 50325097